Now you both have been through this stardom thing. Did you give your friend here any advice about what he's going through, what he's having to handle right now? Um, no, because the one thing that's amazing about Leo is that um, he's um, um, incredibly level-headed, you know, and um, really unaffected and down to earth, and um, that's really rare uh, considering everything that's happening, you know. Um, I wouldn't presume to give him advice. In fact, uh, it would be the other way around. I would be going to him sometimes for advice. It's true. He's how a... are you handling all this, all this acclaim? Um, I don't really know. I don't know how I'm handling it. I'm just sort of dealing with it as it comes, like, uh, on a day-to-day -day basis, that's all, you know. Can you still go out in public? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah? I do all the time, for sure. Now, I heard some, you got chased through the Louvre, is that right, by a mob of girls in France? Yeah, yeah. It was pretty hilarious. I was like whizzing by the Mona Lisa at 50 <laughs> miles an hour. <laughs> they had like mm -hmm. a whole bunch of Italian girls, which were kind of crazy. But that happens about. often to you now, right? Mobs no, of women? No, not really. No? Not really, no. Depends. It depends if, you know, I'm announced as being someplace, but I go, I go wherever I want usually for the most part. For Leo in Europe, it's amazing. He's more than a, than a rock star, you know? Really? Oh. Is uh, every, so yes, yes. It's like but hanging yes, out yes. with the Beatles, right? Yes. Oh yes. <laughs> he's, he's anxious. <laughs> he's anxious. Did you have any idea when you were making Titanic that it would receive all this acclaim and make all this money? Um, I knew it was going to make money. I knew that. I had no idea it would be this. I mean, it's uh, it's truly unbelievable what's been going on with it. It really is. Mm. <laughs> when you look in the mirror, though, women from eight to eighty are swooning over you. Do you see? Sex symbol when you look in the mirror? Well, well uh, when I think of sex symbol, it's hard. It's hard because there have been people. It's hard for me to talk about the issue of being a sex symbol because you know I think much like the people that I've worked with in this movie and these guys next to me, you want to be an actor first and foremost, and sometimes being the sex symbol sort of status is something that comes and goes. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And it, it's there sometimes and it's not or whatever. And the only thing you could sort of count on is being an actor and. And um, so it's like a shifty subject because, you know, who really knows, who, who finds who's sexy and, wh and whatnot. You want to, you know, you want to do what you love and that's acting.